Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel Metallurgical Engineering. In this video, we will see about little bit more type of low carbon steel. So that is dual phase steel. So dual phase steels are characterized by some special facts like uh, absence of it is continuous yield point second a low ratio of yield is done. to tensile strength. Third is high work hardening rate. Fourth high tensile strength. Fifth large uniform elongation. Okay, so these are the few characteristics of dual phase steel. Now we will see about more about dual phase steel. So, what is more like low carbon sheets are needed in the intercritical region of the iron carbon phase diagram and then cooled. So, intercritical region of iron carbon diagram. And then cool rapidly enough to convert the austenite part to lath martensite or lath martensite. Okay. So the final molecular structure of this steel consists of 15 to 20 percent of martensite in the form of that is martensite isolates. In a fine grained ferrite, fine grained ferrite, okay. So the mechanical properties of this dual phase steel are like yield strength increases that is 350 MP in comparison to the low carbon steel which I explained in the last video and tensile strength also increases around 650 MP and percentage elongation that is around 30 percent that is almost same so the formality of dual phase steel is only slightly inferior to the conventional low carbon steel because the elements and tensile strength is more than the low carbon steel so but they have the advantage of there is no looter bend formation during formation okay so due to the high work hardening rate as I told high work hardening rate the strength increases to due to high work hardening rate the strength increases to around 550 MPa okay this is strength in MTV after only 3% of plastic strain so up to this much only plastic strain the strength 
plastic up to this much plastic strain the strength increases to 550 ampere okay the dual piece steels are also used in various stamped automobile components such as bumpers application if you see example car bumpers wheel disc door panels etc so weight saving by as much as 10 percent is possible due to this steel and we can say in generally transportation purposes this tool with this deal is very important okay. so for this video up to here only so you can take the recap like dual phase steel so absence of the uh, discontinuous yield point and uh, ratio of yield strength to the tensile strength high work hardening rate high tensile strength and a large uniform elongation these are the facts and uh, intergetical region of iron carbon diagram it is heat in this region so it will be cooled rapidly enough to convert the austenite part to the lath martin site so the tensile strength and yield strength will increase due to the presence of this lath martin site and uh, there is no load of formation during deformation so this is the benefit of this tool with steel and the examples are basically vehicles or uh, transportation items like uh, maybe in the automobile sector you see car bumpers, wheel disc and door panels so please stay connected and uh, like share subscribe our youtube channel thank you